I'm made for so much more than this Victory sure guaranteed Every day empowered to succeed Striving I try Soaring every day No, no limitation Anytime, anywhere We are the takeover generation. We are that army written prophetically in the book of Joel chapter 2. They will fall upon the sword. They shall not be wounded. A generation that no other generation has seen. You go into the market and break monopoly. You shake systems and structure. Everywhere the Bible is a war book. Fight the good fight of faith. You are not fighting to win. You are fighting from the point of victory. Drive 365. Be empowered to succeed anytime, anywhere, any day. This message is absolutely prophetic. This message makes the difference between the rich and the poor. This message makes all the difference between failures and those that are successful. If there is a message you must get, is this one. And add it to your archives of up-to-date Christian menu from the throne room of grace. Many people wonder how come they don't succeed. God makes all things beautiful in his own time, not your own time. God makes all things beautiful in his own time, not your own time. I'm speaking on recovery of wasted years. Recovery of lost time. Now, hear me carefully. Life is timed. Progress is timed. Even birth to death is timed. Achievement is timed. Accomplishment is timed. Significance is timed. And any believer, even any mortal man, who doesn't understand the mystery of times and seasons, will surely fail on planet Earth. When I was moving from Oyo State to this place, God told me clearly, you are one year late. You are one year late. I am a beneficiary of recovery of wasted time. Recovery of wasted years. And this is an apostolic impartation. Some of you, you need to go back with this message and sit down with it for seven days. On a daily basis, following this ministration. Life is timed. Accomplishment is timed. You don't have forever. Open with me, God's precious people. Ecclesiastes chapter 3, verse 1. Give me amplified. To everything there is a season. Please note this. To everything there is a season. And a time for every matter. Or purpose under heaven. In as much as you are under heaven, everything is timed. You didn't determine where you will be born, when you will be born. So your times and your seasons are not timed by you. They are not what you can manipulate. They pre-exist you. Please understand carefully. Sometimes I weep as I see people who don't understand these dynamics. 
to every purpose, there is a time allocated. There is a time to start master's place. There is a time to finish dreamland and move in. There is a time to marry, have children. There is a time to accomplish the purpose of God for your life according to his timetable. Can I have other translations quick? Look at CEV. Everything on earth has its own time and its own season. Everything on earth has its own time and its own season, including your entire life. There is when to marry. There is when to start having children. According to divine agenda, there are a lot of people gifted. There are a lot of people skilled. There are a lot of people <laughs> educated who live meaninglessly, sincerely speaking, because everything about the time and the season of their life is missed. Do you know even the Bible makes us to understand this? That as long as the earth remains, seed time and then harvest time. There is a time to plant. There is a time to reap. Your life has planting seasons. In life, you only have two places you can be. The place of preparation or the place of manifestation. If you are not in the place of manifestation, you are in the place of preparation. If you jump the place of preparation and rush into the place of manifestation, you will surely meet calamity. God forbid. They are see a bro and they are see a braco shia dakas. They see bring a to break a shia dakas. This is a generation that is now running elter skelter because they don't really understand how things work. When is your time and when is the season for it, the lies will fall to you in pleasant places. When is your time and is the season for it, suddenly supplies will be made available. You must know that your entire life is governed by this principle. May I ask you, your life, according to God's agenda, you don't need to go to a prophet with beards to be telling you visions. The Bible made us to understand that as many as are led by the Spirit of God, they are the sons of God. And that only those who are led by the Spirit of God, they are the real sons of God. Somebody shout with me, I'm a son of the Most High God. I want you to scream it authoritatively. This has nothing to do with gender. Scream it authoritatively. Answer this question. If truly your life will be great, in line with the word of God, do you know the particular season you are in your life? You know, like first semester, Second semester. Do you know the semester of your life you are in? Many live anyhow. If within the next two years, we don't pack to our permanent site, a part of my ministry is gone. If we don't start TV when we started, I'm behind schedule. Follow me carefully. I have been helped so I can talk to you. He told me, he said, marry before you are 27 plus, 27. I married 26 years plus. Myself and first lady married August 16th. By September 4th, I will be 27. I told first lady, we will not marry 27 years plus one day. It was very strong. Everybody listening. I was a missionary in Chad. I'm not talking about ambition. I'm talking about vision. 
I'm not talking about reaction. I'm talking about vision. Walking according to the plan and purpose of God for your life. And the spirit of God will bear witness with your spirit. An anointing is coming on you tonight. Even where you missed it, there shall be restoration. Everyone hearing me now, where you have missed it, there shall be restoration. A lot of people are carnal. They are carnal. There is a time, if they give you money, you better reject it. It's not time, oh. If they give you some positions, you better reject it. <laughs> it's not yet time. You know the meaning of premature birth. You know the challenges that comes with premature birth. If you are too early, it's not good. When you are too early and it's a product of divine speed, it prepares you for that. I woke up in the nation of Chad and God said to me, Marry quick or miss it. Then I was able to communicate with First Lady. The same day, somebody shout with me, the same day. day. Winners Chapel, Rajo Oba, my church. Where I grew up from, and my father, Bishop Bedepo, released me to start this one. They finished service. And first lady said, he will go and greet, she will go and greet our resident pastor then. That happened to be my spiritual father too. The resident pastor of the church. And then first lady entered his office and suddenly he said to first lady, sit down. Look into my eyes. And he spoke in tongues for three to five minutes. And said to first lady, look straight into my eyes. Let me tell you about your tomorrow. As first lady was looking straight into his eyes, he looking straight into first lady's eyes, he began to speak in tongues. And suddenly he stopped speaking in tongues and said, marry him now or lose him forever. Sir, I have been guided to this point. That's why when I speak, I speak with authority. This ministry is dangerously guided by grace. So it's not that I'm just taking steps. It's not that I'm just taking steps. And I am here with the fullness of grace for your rescue. Every one of you that has missed it, except the will of God is not upon my life, This night is your night of recovery. My God will rescue you tonight. Now you will be delivered from the spirit of lateness. Tell your neighbor, there is a time, there is a time, there is a time. Tell another neighbor, there is a time. Tell another neighbor, there is a time. Still tell another neighbor, there is a time. We live in a generation. That everything is in dominodus, two minutes. This Yahoo generation, Yahoo plus, Yahoo ordinary, Yahoo minus, Yahoo, 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 Yahoo. Everything, they just want it, everything, they just want it until they are destroyed. Until they are destroyed. Lift up your right hand. Please, I am anointed from the crown of my head to the sole of my feet. Look, except you are not serious with God. If you are serious with God, this night is your night. Lift, lift up your right hand. Repeat after me, by the power of the Holy Ghost, the the Holy Ghost I, receive I receive grace to follow the plan of God for my life. From tonight, from tonight as, I am anointed, as I am anointed, I will walk in the perfect will of God. Let me hear your believing name, eh? amen. Look up. I was in Botswana, shaking the whole city. They transferred me back to Nigeria. One of the most influential women in the city came to me and in the church and offered me money that in case I don't want to go back to Nigeria and I want to stay in Botswana, and leave winners, they will, she will give me all the support 
I wanted. Always separate good idea from God idea. An idea can be good, but it's not from God for you. It's not the will of God for you. Today, I say it with all humility. Quite some of my friends that settled in South Africa, my life is a mystery to them. When I was living, he told me, he said, get back to your father's land. It's time to rebuild it. He first told me to study the book of Nehemiah. Not believers today who live anyhow, they relocate anyhow. They are not guided by anything. They, they just hear that a company is employing people in Dubai. They carry their luggage and move. They just hear that America, there are jobs everywhere. They pick up, they go. They are after greener pasture. Hmm. I see Atolia, Andre Sibrikitish. The precursor of Abraati Gashia Dakar. Lift up your right hand again. Repeat after me violently. Please be violent now. Say, by the power of the Holy Spirit. By the power of the Holy Spirit. The anointing that raised Christ from the dead. I enter into the perfect will of God for my life from tonight. Let me hear your believing amen. I finished NYSC. They were already calling me uh, Pastor K. I had not gone to Bible school. And God said I should go and join Bishop Redepo Ministries. Two influential women in Jaws came, offered me property, that the grace of God, they can see it upon my life. I should start church. That will have been my end. We were to start Master's Place. One of the richest men in this town offered me over 50 million and told me that he will start a fellowship in his house and I should come and be pastor in it and it will be their family church. All benefits presented before me. They are so good and the one I'm to start looking as if there is no future in it. We don't even have any money. From 50 million, he told me that if I take his offer, he will give me 50 million. He's one of the richest in this town. And I will be their family pastor. I can go to London anytime. I can go to America anytime. I can go to anywhere anytime. Is your life governed by those things? Follow me tonight. I'm sharing from the depth of the spirit. Hey, I have zero, I mean zero attachment to material things. He now told me that if I don't take his own offer to go and start master's place, he will give me five million. Even that five million is like five billion to me. Because we are starting master's place here by faith. Then he told me to come and take the five million. I got there. He said, there is no problem. You are not taking my offer. You don't want to do what I want you to do. This is all I have for you, 220,000. It was like I was a child about to pour my body and they remove pampas. Humanly speaking, before I went to him that at least with 5 million, we will pay almost one year for this place. We will buy instruments. We will buy this. We will buy that. We will buy this. We will buy that. We will do this. We will do that. Whatever it takes, pay the price to follow the will of God. Follow me tonight. Sometimes I look at some people, I weep. Because they've missed it. They've missed it. The Kessia Dakara. The Brusia Agashia Dekeris. Let us read it in ERV. Quickly, Ecclesiastes chapter 3, verse 1. There is a right time for everything. And everything on earth will happen at the right time. This is the key that governs the universe. When you are in your season, you are in your time. And you see, you 
you can't create wave, you can only flow with wave. When it is your time, your wave will come. You are now to position yourself and move with it. Look at Siabra. Look at me. What happens when it is not planting season and you are planting? Talk to me. When it is not planting season and you are planting, what happens? A, a lot of people, everything they do about their life because of quest for material things, quest for this, quest for that, everything they do about their life is always out of season. Always. They wake up 56, they are blaming. They wake up 60, they are blaming. There is a time to sow some seed. There is a time not to use a car. Look, there is a time to be in rented apartment. There is a time to pay the price for destiny. The moment you miss planting season, you have missed harvest season. Is is correlated together. Let's see, Brakasha. There are see this. The prondi sedia atia akiata. Only God can override time because He created it. The moment you miss a destiny time, which is God's timetable for your life, you will always need the hand of God back to get it back. Hmm. Now, everybody look at this great secret. Ecclesiastes chapter 9, verse 11. Yet, another thing I observed under the sun is that races aren't won by the swift or battles by the strong. It's to let you know skilled expertise, they don't <laughs> always have their way. And that food doesn't go to the wise or wealth to the intelligent or favor to the expert. Rather, time and chance rule them all. Life is ruled by time. Your time is your chance. Please note this. You can be skilled and you will never be successful in life. Why? You miss your time. You can be connected and things will never work. Why? You miss your time. Brekosi ekotia abrakashas. Lekis imbro e prakasha. I am weeping on my inside because this is an apostolic <laughs> impartation. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, wherever you have missed it, you are getting it back. We believe this message from Pastor KK has empowered you. For more life transforming messages, information, prayers, and counseling, please call. Plus two three four seven zero six eight eight two nine two double nine, or send an email to contact us at themastersplace.org, or visit our website at www.themastersplace.org. We invite you to worship with us in our open heaven services every Sunday. First service six forty five a.m. Second service. 8 a.m. Third service, 9.15 a.m. Fourth service, 10.30 a.m. Fifth service, Business and World Creation service, 2 p.m. Sixth service, Youth and Young Adult service, ya yeah, ya, yeah, 4 p.m. And in our Fresh Fire service, every Wednesday by 4.30 p.m. At the Master's Place International Church, Church Unusual, Synergy Center. 190 Jakma Road, Ephraim Wari, Delta State, Nigeria. You can be a part of our ever growing social media community. Like us on Facebook at The Master's Place. Follow us on Twitter at The Master's Place. Welcome to a world of reformation. We celebrate you.